Welcome everybody, it's Turbo Terramino here, and today's a great day because we are back playing Monkey Island 2 Revenge of LeChuck, special edition that is. Um, last we left off, uh, we were actually able to get three pieces of the map to bring us over to Big Whoop, the mysterious treasure that is Big Whoop. We have a fourth one coming up soon. We are close to getting it last night, but we ran into time, uh, so we stopped. We're actually a pretty good um, length through the game at this moment. Uh, I think we're at like 70%. We'll see the percentage in a minute. I'm glad you're doing well, Code Mars. Making dinner. What you making for dinner? I had a, I had a big uh, breakfast slash lunch. Brunch. Uh, today. That was my big meal for the day. I'm trying not to eat anything heavy late in the day, so... I had some keto-friendly pound cake, which is good. It raises my fat level. Um, so I had that. I, uh, did a couple car decals for my, uh, my friend who's running for local city council. And, uh... So I did that right when I got off of work. And, uh... And ate, uh, two pieces of pound cake. It was wonderful. I uh, sent out some subscriber gifts, uh, emails, and uh, we're, get, we're getting ready to play into uh, some Monkey Island. Cornish hens, rice, and broccoli. You guys eat like kings and queens over there. All right, so we're 70% done through the game here. Uh, we just got the third map piece here. Now, in order to get the fourth map piece, we need to go to uh, that that one guy's house that. Uh, that was trying to get us drunk. Oh, we can leave the boards there. I don't think we need them. Uh, oh, he's not on this island. Let's go to Dread Ship. We got to go to the Mysterious Triangle. Whatever he said. Village de la Butte. Where do you want to go? I want to go here. We can't go there, man. That's the forbidden dihedron. Dihedron. Yeah. Fat Island. Deep within LeChuck's fortress, blah, 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 blah. Oh, the narrator's getting bored. Scum. Largo. Yeah. Uh-oh. You called for me? Is it true that Guybrush Threepwood has found the third piece of the map to Big Whoop? Ah, uh, yes, sir. I was about... Why did you not come and tell me yourself? Well, I was trying to confirm that he really... Largo, uh -oh. you have been my trusted henchman for many years, but I won't hesitate to drag your entrails from behind my ship Ooh. if you do not bring me Guybrush before he finds that treasure! Okay. So that was, uh, was very threatening. I think I can go down here. I think this is a faster way than going up through that. That pathway. Yeah, we'll go over here. So I remember some of this puzzle. Again, I have a guide up. Uh, so worst case scenario, when I get stuck, I will refer to it. But I, not without trying out the puzzle a couple times. Yeah, the big breakfast that I had earlier was, uh, or brunch rather, it was uh, a bunch of meat cubes I already cooked up with seasonings and beef broth and all kinds of stuff like that. And then uh, some scrambled eggs, so I had some protein there in the morning to counteract the fat from the, my coffee. Alright, so we gotta use a telescope with this grotesque statue. Harambe. It's like Indiana Jones. Oh. Hello, Mr. Monkey. Uh, sir? It's a grotesque monkey statue. It's a grotesque monkey statue. Alright, so how do we get this to stay? Hmm. What else can we use? Will he hold a stick? doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. Wood polish won't do anything. Murray! Oh, hey, cake. 
How you doing tonight? Uh, no, that's for later. I don't think that'll work. How you doing tonight? This one too. It's stuck. All right, so maybe that's what I had to do, so the beam can go in. There we go. Aha! Oh, now we know where it is. Come on, guy, brush to Aventure. This guy is literally dead on the floor. Uh, was this brick? We'll push it. Whoa. Who would do such a thing? Jeez, his head. Jeez. I still can't make heads or tails of it. I think I need an expert. Dang it, Vincent. Skeletons don't talk. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Pull on the skeleton. Come on, it'll be funny. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. Come on, Guybrush, just do it. Pick him up. Yeah, I don't want to touch it. All right, fine. Let's go out this hole. All right, so that looks like that is what we needed. Ugh, why are you going to make me go through this dang catacomb? Hey, Ian. By the way, I sent you an email. Um, for the uh, subscriber gift. I didn't make the uh, the document all nice and pretty, but I removed the ones that uh, are no longer available. And uh, what I'm going to do is uh, get your stuff and uh, Arya's stuff. Cause, uh, <coughs> excuse me. I haven't sent out Arya's stuff yet. Move? And uh, I'm going to send your stuff out uh, probably by this weekend. All right, so we're gonna go to Scab Island. Ooh, another cutscene. Good joke, sir. I got good news and I got bad news. The bad news is the guy brushes found the last piece of the map. Nah, the good news is that I got a plan that can't fail. Ah, you see, he must take the map to a cartographer to have it deciphered. I'll head him off before he gets there. If your plan fails, it will not, your voodoo lordship. Alright, so we gotta be careful. Largo Legrand is, is on our tail. But I know one cartographer that can help us out here. You guys remember that guy that we stole the monocle from? Well, look. I'm gonna die hungry, blind, and alone. We found this little lighthouse lens. Why me? Here you go, Wally. Ah. That'll work. Thanks. We got all these these map pieces. And I need your help figuring them out. What's this? A map? Hmm. Looks like only part of a map. I've got the rest of it right here. Hmm. Very interesting. Can you put it all together into one map for me? I'll do it for you if you'll run an errand for me. Go to the International House of Mojo and ask the fortune teller if my love potion's ready. Okay. I'll try to have this done for you when you come back. Wally, you don't need a love potion, buddy. Someone will love you for just who you are. A weird little map wiener guy. Alright, so let's go talk to the voodoo lady. So, Cake, what do you uh, what do you think about the current SmackDown storyline? International line? House of Mojo. Uh, with uh, Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn. I'm gonna play this during the move because a, a while ago I bought all of the iOS, 
Shut up, Ian. You actually have them on iOS? I heard they didn't play well, but I never bought them. It's eh. I actually love the Kevin Owens storyline and Sami Zayn. I was actually hoping it would, it would turn into a uh, a fight with um, Daniel Bryan and Shane fighting at WrestleMania. But I don't think that's going to happen. I think they're just going to make Shane probably fight Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens in a triple threat match. Shane will win because KO and, and Sami will end up fighting each other. They play great. That's really good to know. I really, really wish I had them on my phone. Um, I'm sure there's a way to... I have to look and see if I can get scum on my iPhone without jailbreaking it. Because that's how I'm going to be able to play Curse of Monkey Island in maybe even... Uh, Escape from Monkey Island. I think that's probably going to be easier than pulling out my PS2 Slim and hooking that up, but we'll see. Wally sent me to pick up some love potion. Oh, okay. Tell him I said to enjoy, but to be careful. It's powerful stuff. Wouldn't want that little guy getting hurt. Oh. Wait. I just felt a sudden disturbance in the force. The force? As if a tiny, tiny voice just called out in fear and then hastily scratched a message in a table. I think Wally's in trouble. And I think LeChuck has something to do with it. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I better go check. Same graphics, just a uh, little different controls. Same touch, pull, push bar thing and whatnot. But they're only four bucks for all. Where are you finding this? This is on the iOS store? If you if it is still up there because I can't find them anymore, please push a link or put a link in the Discord for me because I would love to buy them and have, have them on my phone. Just to have them. I wish I could have all the Monkey Islands on my phone, but... Technically, you can buy the Tales games. The Tales uh, of Monkey Island. That's like the most recent game. You're saying it's in the app store. I looked like a week ago and I couldn't find him. Where'd he go? Yes, thank you, Ian. Someone's hastily scratched a message here. It just says, LeChuck. Oh no, LeChuck's kidnapped the cartographer. The poor little guy. His name is Wally. He has my map. All right, so what are we going to do? It just says, LeChuck. Oh, wait. Can we get these maps finally? I can't reach it. No. All right, so let's go back to the voodoo lady, I think. I think we're relatively at the end of the game here. We're saving that other uh, save for an achievement. 74%. Come on, just go there quickly. I could have preferred a little bit more violent thing than jumping Shane. Uh, they're not going to fully put them out because they're going to build them up for a WrestleMania match. That's why. So he still needs to come back from that. Guybrush, you don't have any time to waste. I can offer you no more help. Your destiny is in your own hands now. Okay, but wh where am I going? I don't understand where I'm going. Nobody said anything. Um, what I would like the storyline to go is Kevin Owens somehow turning good or looking good. In comparison to Sammy, I want Sammy to become more of like a villain and more of a bad guy. I just checked my iPad and they aren't there. That's what I'm saying. I thought they were all like out of the store. From what I heard, the Monkey Island games fell out of the iStore. I looked online and I said they got removed. Yes, exactly, because they didn't update the... Because 
they were they required Lucas Arts to update the applications in because you want to go. because Disney bought out Lucas Arts and then canned the entire video game option that they didn't have a staff to continue to update the iPhone app. So some people have it on their phones, but you can't get it anymore. Litwack, wow, Monkey Island 2, best Lucas game. What's going on, Litwack? Um, we're on, uh, we're pretty much good to almost beat this game tonight. I just don't know where to go at this point. Uh, we're, uh, maybe we should see Elaine? Elaine bounced, though. Cruises. Um. Check it out. You check it out. Step up to the line and test your swell. What? They were on my iPad last month. Prove to me Wait. That you guys are at least as fun as a pack of llamas. The applications are literally removed or they're just not in the store? Because if they're, like, straight removed, then that's really messed up. My favorite Litwack, by the way, my favorite Monkey Island game is Curse of Monkey Island. So once we're done with this game, what's today? Wednesday? Uh, I'm probably going to be streaming earlier tomorrow than normal. Uh, but we're going to start up Monkey Island uh, 3, Curse of Monkey Island, tomorrow night. I'm so, so excited for it. I don't think Elaine is here, to be honest, but we'll uh, we'll take a look. Those, those guys are so weird. No. You know, on my iPad, they were downloaded. Can you check your purchases? And see if they're in the purchased area. Some party, eh? Try the fish? Yeah. Almost choked on a bone. Gross. Okay, let's go. So Litwack, this is your favorite Monkey Island game? Now some true Monkey Island fans will say this is the last Monkey Island game true to Ron Gilbert. Um, because three and on aren't technically the babies of, uh, yeah, see, you just said it. Best Lucas game, Monkey Island 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, but 3, 4, and 5 aren't Lucas. Indiana Jones, Fate of the Atlante, Grim Fandango, Day of the Tentacle, uh, Thimbleweed Park. I haven't played Thimbleweed Park. I've been, I've been told to play it. That's Ron Gilbert game. Day of the Tentacle, I love Day of the Tentacle. I actually... Uh, I didn't stream it on my channel here. I streamed it on um, on the Kanoki okay Gamer channel, but I did the remastered version of Data Tentacle. I actually have the original disc behind me, behind my green screen on my video game shelf. That is another one I love. Thank you so much for the host. Really appreciate it. Oh, wait, I think I remember where to go. I gotta go on Fat Island. Oh, gosh, okay. Conspiracy theory. Let me think of one. All right. So, a lot of people feel differently in regards to... Um, injections. So, you get your shots, right? Like, for example, like a flu vaccine... Um, a lot of people, conspiracy theorists now, believe that these vaccines are actually where they're testing um, any type of uh, new population, what I want to say, uh, ways to whittle down the population. So they feel like when people were given polio shots back in the day, uh, they were actually given light traces of cancer or that um, governments are actually creating um, AIDS or um, different types of viruses that pass along like SARS and almost like the Black Plague introduce them into populations in cities where they can slow down the, the population growth uh, because it's a drain on resources. So some conspiracy theorists actually feel that uh, the government is behind a lot of these sicknesses um, that a lot of people have nowadays, so including like cancer and stuff. I know it's a little touchy subject with people with cancer, but um, I've got a, I got a couple good friends of mine that are dealing with it right now. But uh, some people feel that that's what is going on, which is crazy. Thank you.
All right, so this is where we got to go now. We got to go in this this cave. Sorry, I forgot. I forgot Sam and Max hit the road the most difficult. I I try to play Sam and Max, but I never got around to playing Sam and Max. And to be honest with you, I have Grim Fandang on my phone. Uh, do I have it anywhere else? I have it on my PS4. Um, but I couldn't really get attached to Grim Fandango. I don't know why. Like, I never played all the way through. I think I'm supposed to be going through here. Right? Oh, I'm in the wrong area. Turbo, do you want... Who do you want to win? The, who do you want to win? Team Little Big or Team Asuka? Um, I would love uh, Team Little Big to win, but they're not going to win. The way that it'll work is Braun Strowman will get too focused on beating up The Miz. And uh, that's where... Where do you want to go? That's, he'll get distracted, and that's where Asuka's going to... Uh, gonna beat up um what's her face i'm blanking for the moment gonna beat up bliss and uh that's how they'll end up winning oscar that way so oscar streak won't leave or won't stop and uh, that way braun Strowman won't lose all right so we're gonna go hide in this crate i think there's something moving in here hey rich i sure could use a hand with this one uh, looks like another box of live snakes. Sounds like it, too. Snakes! Well, let's get it on the truck. Here we go. This is the remastered the version. Yes, it is. Of voodoo supplies that would be his home for the next five days and nights. Guybrush is forced to eat bat lungs and eel bladders to stay alive it's not Eventually, bad just eat one a day Guy brush and the rest of the slithering cargo are delivered to the very doorstep of the caribbean's most fearsome villain living or dead the ghost pirate red chuck ah the chuck's crate of voodoo supplies you know, we usually don't deliver out this far, and... You guys fucking for a tip? Well, we figured since... Well, you figured wrong. Largo... Chuck don't tip nobody. Gee, what a butt. What a butt! In the DOS version, you can choose easy way or hard way. Ick. I yeah. hate snakes. I don't know. Actually, you know what? That's a good... Uh, statement, Litwack. I'm not entirely sure if this is an easy or difficult road in regards to um, the difficulty on this game. I know for M Curse of Monkey Island, because I know that game like the back of my hand, I do M Mega Monkey every single time. She's pretty much a Nine Tails. <laughs> By the way, I love Asuka. Broken Sign. Back Tunnel. I don't know. All right, so here's here's the 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 thinger. Let's see. I wrote this down last night. The hip arm. The wait. The hip is connected to the arm. Connected to the head. The head connected to wait. This one. Okay. All right, the next one was the leg bone connected to the hip. No. So maybe not these ones. Leg, hip, arm. So maybe this one. Okay. And then it's head, rib, leg. Head, rib, I, I suit, because yeah, these are arms. Head, rib, leg. Okay. 
And the last one is arm, head, rib. Arm, head, rib. I hope I got these right. Let's see. Here we go, baby. Good thing I take a notes. The sing of your parent. That's such a weird way. This game gets really weird with their puzzles. That was a very weird puzzle. All right. There is no way, not even in an adventure game, that I'd be able to get all those locks open. Oh, well, it's unlocked, so no big deal, right? Uh, let's pick up this voodoo jail key. Why not, right? No! I got caught! LeChuck! Guy Brush Threepwood. You have finally been caught. He knew my kleptomania. I every island. Sailed every sea. And now, you are mine. What do you have to say for yourself? It would have been easier if you left directions. Gee, nice going. Stop spitting in my face! If I could just reach my pirate utility belt. Largo. Oh, you wouldn't say it. Yes, sir, LeChuck, sir. Take Guybrush down to the torture chamber and get the machine set up. Yes, sir. Oh, no. <laughs> you be in a heap of trouble, Guybrush Threepwood. Now that you are mine, you will pay for what you did to me. Hey, Zach. A root beer between friends. Silence! There is only one thing more painful than being resurrected from the dead and crammed into a rotting body. What? Do you know what that is? Hmm. Tell me fights like a cow. What is about to happen <laughs> to you? Can't we talk this thing out? You see that candle over there? When it burns through that rope, the bag will fall on the bellows. When it is compressed, it will shoot a single lead bullet, which will ricochet off that pan, then off the shield behind me, Bounce off that other shield, finally striking the green balloon. Why so complicated? When it pops, it will cause that lever to fall, releasing that ratchet on the chain wheel, and sending you down into the pit of acid. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, gee, I, uh... Do you know what happens next? Um, well... I will take your bones, still alive and in great pain, and make them into a chair. I will call it... My screaming chair. Every morning I will sit in it and listen to you scream. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's so evil. Any questions? Uh, what does the candle do? What happens when the bag falls on the bellows? What kind of lead bullet is going to hit the balloon? If this is four and this is two, what is this? Why do adventure games cost so much? <laughs> The skull and head, shoulders, mage is, is literally hard for me. I haven't passed this without help. Yeah, so when your parents sing to you, they're like, the arm bone's connected to the head bone, the head bone's connected to the rib bone. So you gotta write that, arm, head, rib. And like, that is the sequence. Um, so I'm gonna say this. If this is four and this is two, what's this? One. Who in the World Series in 56? Chicago. This enigma is very funny. Why didn't you just shoot me when I came in? I'm growing tired of your stupid questions. Prepare to die. No! Alright, so let's save it real quick. Because I don't know if this is an option where Guybrush dies. I have the other save file right here if he can drown underwater. So we'll save the main one here as well. Because we're going to get that achievement once we're done here. Okay. He didn't say wh what he was going to do to me. Uh, an Ottoman comes to mind. Wally, not everything is about you, okay, man? Nice. All right, All right so let's do this. Remember the whole spitting contest? Well, let's take a sip of the spit old drink. This stuff makes my spit thick. Pooey. Nope. All right. Let's spit. Let's spit on Wally. Pooey. Hey, watch <laughs> it with the spit. 
The spit on the shield. Hey, watch it with the spit. Okay. You spit on the balloon. Hey, watch it with the spit. Okay. What do we do? Spit on the balloon. My hmm. mouth is all dried up. All right, we gotta figure this out, or we're gonna die. Boy, this stuff makes my spit thick. The number one rule of LucasArts is never die in a game. That is true, because they wanted to be unlike Sierra games, but uh, they do die in this game, and they die in number one as well. Hey, watch it with a spit. All right, that redirected, I think. Hey, watch <laughs> it with a spit. Okay, so. Hey, watch it with a spit. Spit at him again. All right, so hey, hit the shield. Watch it with a spit. Now that I hit the shield. My mouth is all dried up. So now the shield is maybe in the correct direction. That pan, that is. So let's see where else we can Boy, spit. This stuff makes my spit thick. Let's try again on the shield. Hey, okay. Watch it with a spit. All right, so let's change the direction of this. Hey, watch it with a spit. In a Sierra game like King's Quest, you can die or block because you get because you have lost the item. Very difficult. Yeah, I know LucasArts set themselves to be different than Sierra games because Sierra games got really difficult. Um, with that kind of stuff. Hey, watch it with a spit. I'm just gonna keep spitting on this shield. <laughs> hmm. My mouth is all dried up. Boy, this stuff makes my spit thick. All right. Hey, watch it with a spit. Now let's try the shield. <laughs> Running out of time. Hey, watch it with a spit. Oh, I'm just noticing this shield is actually changing directions. Okay. <laughs> yeah, baby! <laughs> Try to trap me. Arr! What be going on in here? Largo, relight the candle. <clears throat> Guybrush has escaped. Find him. Ha! Huh. I bet LeChuck is really cheesed off now. Yep. Hey, Wally? Yeah? Where are we? Good question. Shoot like Cristiano Ronaldo, that with effect. <laughs> okay. Uh, stuff, crates, stuff, stuff, crates, stuff, uh, let's take our knife out. Who wants to mess with me? It's too dark to see what I'm doing. I can't tell what this stuff is. That's too heavy to pick up. Just pick up the stuff. That's too heavy to pick up. I can't find the lid in the dark. I can't find the lid in the dark. Ugh, they're too heavy to pick up. Can I move? I can't tell what this stuff is. That's too heavy to pick up. All right, well, what can I light on fire? There's some stuff in here. What's in the juju bag? I think that these are matches. And this thing feels like a bomb. Hey, we're not allowed to say words like that. Holy skunk sweat. Oh, Ouch. gosh. Kybrush, no, what are you doing? No! You gonna die! Oh my goodness, that effect looks so cool. Part 5, a doo doo doo. Oh, there's four, excuse me. I forgot my Roman numerals. Dinky Island. Hours later. Jeez. Oh, 
let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. Welcome to Dinky Island, home of the treasure of Big Whoop. <gasps> we made it! Cracker. Oh, no, no, that's not right. It's empty. Oh, what is, oh sweet, a curl right, bar. With it. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Oh, no, no, oh geez, it's Herman Toothrot again. Herman Toothrot, what are you doing here? Oh, hi. I've been waiting for you. <laughs> Vincent! <laughs> you happy to see Herman Toothrot? What do you mean you've been waiting for me? What are you doing here? I'm looking for treasure. Have you seen any? I think I have better things to do than talk to you. What do you mean you've been waiting for me? Our meeting comes at this, the final moment of my existence so far. All else has been in anticipation of this event. He really is crazy. Do you mean to tell me that your whole life has been merely a prelude to meeting me here today? Yours too. But see, already the moment passes. Now our meeting is nothing more than another note in the grand overture to the next passage. What are you doing here? I'm teaching philosophy here. Right here? On the beach? Sure beats a Tibetan mountaintop. I can go surfing when things are slow. Hmm. What sort of philosophy are you teaching? Neo-existentialist Cartesian Zen Taoism. It's all the rage at cocktail parties this year. What? How many students have you got? <laughs> None at the moment. But Murray. as soon as word gets out that a guru such as myself is teaching at a beautiful locale like this, I'll have to beat them off with a stick. <laughs> I have a stick. Do you want it? Could you teach me some philosophy? Okay. Here's a Zen koan for you. A what? A philosophical puzzle. If a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it, what color is the tree? All right. What color do you guys think the tree is that fell in the forest? We have brown, blue, forest, green, or red, or I give up. I give up is not the answer, by the way. I'll give you guys a second. If a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it, what color is the tree? Brown says cake. Brown? Nope. Not brown. What else do you think it is, guys? You think maybe forest green? Forest green? Not even close. Um. Brown for the bark. What about uh? What about kind? Red? Maybe it's like a redwood. Red? Nah. Blue? Blue? Not even close. Cyan? Not exactly. Lavender? No. Magenta? Not even close. Puce? Not exactly. Aquamarine? Not even close. Taupe? Not exactly. Burnt sienna? Not exactly. Raw umber? Not exactly. Sepia? No. Mulberry? Nah. Periwinkle? Nope. Orchid? Nah. Turquoise? Nope. Peach? Nah. Plum? Nah. Aubergine? Nope. Teal? Nah. Mustard? Nope. Cabernet? Nope. Slate? Not even close. Smoke? Nope. Brick? Nope. Coral? Nope. Chartreuse? Not exactly. Cherry? Nope. Wisteria? Not exactly. Raspberry? Not even close. Vanilla? Nope. Asparagus? Nope. Cranberry? Nah. Sangria? Not even close. Eggshell? Not even close. Driftwood? Nope. Sumac? Not exactly. Alpaca? Not exactly. Storm Gray? Nah. Evening Haze? Not even close. Tarragon? Nah. Sachet? Not even close. Venetian? Nah. Juniper? Not exactly. Drizzle? Not even close. Sweet potato? 
Not exactly. Bayou? Nope. Manila? Not exactly. Macintosh Red? Nope. Mange? Not even close. Shark Bite? Nope. Sashimi Green? Not even close. Ebony? Not even close. Ivory? Not exactly. Menthol? Nope. Sahara? Nope. Salmon? Not even close. Oxblood? Nah. Khaki? Not even close. Fuchsia? Not even close. The chat's so frustrated right now. Robin's egg? Nope. Ash? Nah. Spice? Nah. Copper? Nah. Weathered pewter? Nah. We're getting close. Vermilion? Nope. Metallic burgundy? Nah. Russet? Not even close. Cadmium white? Not even close. Cerulean? Nope. Thalocyanide green? Not exactly. Ochre? Not exactly. Deep purple? Not exactly. Barrel? Nah. We have to be getting close. Hot pink? Not exactly. <laughs> Oatmeal heather? Not exactly. Well, here's the final answer. Here we go. All colors? Exactly! Now, what has this experience taught you? That philosophy isn't worth my time. Oh, I'm very impressed. It takes most people years to reach this point. You have learned all that you can from me. Go forth into the world with confidence. I won't even charge you a buck. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Oh, no, no, that's not right. Burr. That's correct. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. In uh, Escape from Monkey Island, we find out the true story of Herman Tooth Rot. We certainly will get to that, too, uh, once we go through Escape from Monkey Island. Oh, cool, a bag of stuff hanging from a tree. I can't reach it. Cake was fed up. I can't reach it. Well, use a fishing pole or something. I don't think that would be very sporting. What are you talking about? I go smack it. Oh, I don't have all my stuff anymore. It's open. Okay, so... Can I use the monkey with it? I don't think that'll work. Alright, so I don't think I can get this bag yet. But I can get the bag... Eventually. Let's go up this way. Oh my goodness, a TNT box. It's nailed shut. Where's my hammer? Don't tell me I lost the wood shop guy's hammer. He's a crowbar on it. Hey, dynamite. Just Sweet. like it says on the side. Can I pick some up? Yeah, let's pick up all the dynamites. Like the Romarians in fights. All right, let's go up. All right, so this... Okay, so here's an achievement, guys. We're going to do this now. We can use this call box to actually call a hint line. One, nine, zero, zero, seven, four, zero, J, E, D, I. Remember, kids, if you're under 18, ask your parents before calling. Lucasfilm Games hint line. Chester speaking. Oh my god, Chester. It's a whole different chick back in the day. Thank you. You've been very helpful. Goodbye. Yeah, sure. Okay. So that was an achievement that we could get. We got a call to help desk. Alright, so this this um this forest is confusing. It's like the lost forest. They have a lot of these in these uh, Monkey Island games. All right, so we went straight across. We found the TNT. Uh, we went up. And we saw Brontosaurus, but the problem was I continued with my... Yeah, okay, so we'll just go up here. We'll go back up. We'll just keep going up. 
Alright, that's the call box. Alright, so we're back out. Eventually, we gotta get the parrot with us. But we gotta get a way to... Um... Get the parrot to come and follow us. Ooh, shoot. Dang it. That's annoying. So if I'm holding the, uh... The directional, uh... Pad, right? And I'm twisting it, say, left. Or I'm going right now. Because the screen changes, it may bring me to another screen in which I'm on the right side of the screen instead of the left. You need something to find the right way. Uh, I don't think I have anything right now. I know I'm supposed to use the parrot in some way. Oh, shoot. Okay, I remember. I remember at least one puzzle. I'm here. Sorry I'm late, Turbo. Don't be sorry, Carla. I'm just glad to see you. Hope you're doing well. Alright, so we're going to use the dynamite here, if I remember correctly. No? I guess not. So let's continue on. We're fine, you have to do like Romans when fight. Stand in a line and thrust your spear. Let's go this, no. Okay, let's just go in a straight line. Okay, that didn't work. We'll go uh, north to south. I mean, we'll just keep going north. I know there's an area that I have to use the dynamite on, I thought. Go up here. I'm okay, just tired. Dang it. Alright, so once we get to that call box, uh the hint box that's pretty much like they're about to spit you out being like all right well do you want any hints but they don't understand how stubborn i am in worst case scenario i got a i got a guide up that i might use in just a moment <clears throat> i thought this was supposed to be more jungle oop okay let's take a look I think I remember now. On uh, maybe on the island, I know the right way, but oh, you're a hinty boy. Thank you for not being super spoilery. All right, so we're not gonna cut that bag down, but I think we can cut it open. Where's my knife? I don't think I ought to do that. Yeah! He poked himself.
Ja. All right. We got the box of crackers. Happy home designer. I made a home for Marshall. That's awesome. All right, so now let's... I can't reach it. What are you talking about? Reaching what? Let's talk to this bird. Hey, birdo. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Pretty Polly. Okay, let's go over it one more time. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. Pretty Polly. Okay, let's go over it one more time. Oh, the heck with it. He doesn't seem interested. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. It's instant low sodium cracker mix. Just add water. It's oh. instant low sodium cracker mix. Okay, so we Just need add water. We need water. Uh, Polly wants a cracker. Well, only drink part of it. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. Well, only drink part of it. Oh, okay. no, no, that's not right. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. I don't know how to play. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? That doesn't seem to work. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain, not a washout like you. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. Holly wants a cracker. Holly wants a cracker. It's empty. Oh, the heck with it. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Well, only drink part of it. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain, not a washout like you. It's instant low sodium cracker mix. Just add water. It's dry. <laughs> the still's empty. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain, not a washout like you. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Hmm. We gotta get some water. Uh, I'm not in the mood for a swim. So let's go to this pond over here. We see if we can scoop up some water. It looks a bit thick for swimming. Yeah, I don't want any of this revolting sludge. I think that's a bit too much water. Okay. I don't want to polish that. There we go. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. This water is too salty to use with low sodium cracker mix. This water is too salty to use with low sodium cracker mix. That seems to have gotten most of the salt out of it. Oh, the heck with it. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Let's see if we can do it again. seems to have gotten most of the salt out of it. There's no more cracker mix. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. Okay, let's see if we can get him to follow us. 
from the pond to the dinosaur. East from the pond to the dinosaur. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man. A captain, not a washout like you. All right, let's see what he says now. I'm taking notes. Head north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. Okay. Head so north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. All right. So we got something to get us back to the pile of rocks. So at least we know how to get there instead of, like, running around. Can you guys already believe it's Wednesday? We're already halfway through the week. It just feels like we just started. All right, so east from the pond. East from the pond to the dino. All right, so now we're at the dino. We're going to go north from the dino to the pile of rocks. Nope, go this way, guy brush. All right, so now we're to the pile. Oh, here he is. Oh, no, no, that's not right. Pretty Polly. Head north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. Polly wants a cracker. There's no more cracker mix. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man. A captain. He doesn't mm. seem interested. <clears throat> Over it again, so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. I don't think that would be very sporting. Head north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. He doesn't seem interested. All right, oh, so it. let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Okay, let's go over it again, so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. We're just gonna have to shoot here and guess. No, all right, so let's go back. We're going to go north from the dolphin to the pile of rocks. Oh no. It's got us confused. Let's go right here. No. Well, we have to find another box of crackers. That's the problem. Because we got like half the puzzle. Pond. Oops, the last part is missing. Yeah. Are we going to go east? And then north from the dinosaur. See, one thing that it keeps telling us is, at least out of these two, we're going until we reach some sort of monument, right? So we're going to keep going that direction. So now we get the we got him here. No, oh, no, no, that's not right. Okay, let's go over it again, so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. Oh, the heck with it. Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Let's go east again. Okay, let's go over it again, so no one forgets where we buried the treasure. All right, so we can't continue east here. So this is this is obviously gonna mess us up. Well, I guess we can go east. Let's go here. We'll go east. Let's continue going east. Uh, I want to go south down this tree for some reason. <laughs> nope. Okay, so it's empty. So how do I make more crackers though? I ain't got no more cracker mix. I gotta find the crackers. <clears throat> oh the heck with it! Let's make a map and tear it into four pieces. Yeah. Oh, they smell like anchovies. Oh no, no, that's not right. 
They say anchovies on the top. Okay. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. We just have to find more, more crackers. More jungle. Shouldn't be anything else here. Let's look at the tree, though. Nice. I slashed it up pretty well. I can't reach it. All right, so there's nothing else in that box. Stop it, Guybrush. We gotta go east, not west. And then we're gonna go north. Past the dolphin. Okay. I understand you want a cracker. And due east from the pond to the dinosaur. Pretty folly. And north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. And north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. Am I going to explode? Doesn't seem interested. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain. He doesn't seem interested. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Polly wants a cracker. It's lit now. My god, is this dynamite gonna blow up in my pants? So no one forgets where we bury the treasure. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? And due east from the pond to the dinosaur. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? And north from the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man. A captain, not a washout like you. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man. A captain, not a washout like you. Okay, let's go over it again so no one forgets where we bury the treasure. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Where will the last cracker be? I'm not entirely sure. <clears throat> I have an idea. I'm just going to search until it boots me out, but... Okay. Let's go right. Try to use a crowbar on these boxes. See if that does anything. I don't think I ought to do that. Hey, there's a cracker in here. Holly wants a cracker. Yeah. All right, let's go back. From the dinosaur to the pile of rocks. I just hope that Polly just shuts up already. He's squawking too much. You're too funny, Litwack. <clears throat> People who aren't seeing the chat right now, he's he or she, I'm not entirely sure, is being uh, very kind and non spoilery and having a little fun and pointing little tiny hints like, Where will the last cracker be, smiley face? Okay, so now we're gonna give Polly the last cracker. I want my granddaughter to marry a real man, a captain, not a washout like you. And you east from the rocks to the eggs. Uh, east. Gee, Captain Marley, where should we bury the treasure? Oh, look at that. I was going east the whole time. I just needed Polly to tell me. All right, so we have a shovel. Our very first item in the game that we had. I've hit cement. There's a layer of cement at the bottom. Oh, here we go. 
dynamite. Jeez. Great Scott. That was a Doc Brown joke. That came from the direction of Dinky Island. Great Scott. The idiot must be messing with my grandfather's treasure. Ugh, oh, I'd better get over there. Her grandfather's treasure. I can't reach that from here. I can't reach that from here. That must be the treasure of Big Whoop. I'm about to get the Big Whoop treasure. I don't think it'll catch on there. There. I think that'll hold. Oh, yes. Look at that grappling hook. Remember in the beginning of the game, this is where we were at? Here we go, guys. Oh. Die brush. And you showed up about three days later. Will you help me now? Anything to shut you up. That has to have been the longest story I ever heard. He's been telling this is a story the entire time. Oh dear. At least we got the rope back. We didn't get the crowbar though. Oh, light switch. Jeez! Hello, Guybrush. Goodbye, LeChuck. You <laughs> won't escape me this time. I escaped from you before. I can easily do it again. Not so fast. Even if you were I'm to trying escape, to run, I would always be able to find you again. We are bound to one another. Like dreadlocks? Yes, rather like that. Or like brothers. What? Huh? I am your brother. No, no. That's not true. That's impossible. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. No! No! <laughs> and I brought a little surprise for you. That was the whole Star Wars bit. When Vader told Luke that he was his father. Oh, that was so good. Oh. So LeChuck and Guybrush are brothers. I think you being my brother is enough of a surprise for one day. Really? A treat? Am I going to enjoy this? I don't suppose it's a LucasArts game. Uh, I don't suppose it's a LucasArts game. No. Oh no! No way, lol. I walked back into Star Wars. A dolly? The surprise is a dolly? What's with the big, sharp, deadly looking pin? Is this gonna be anything like pin the tail on the donkey? Say, that wouldn't happen to be a voodoo doll, would it? Say, that wouldn't happen to be a voodoo doll, would it? Why, yes, as a matter of fact, it is a voodoo doll, which I'll be using to torture you, and then send you screaming to another dimension, one of infinite pain. Oh my god. Observe. Ah! Ah! Are you quite finished? No, I want to do this. Wow! Oh my god! Oh, that was exhilarating. Let's have some more fun, shall we? <laughs> oh my god, he's gonna kill Guybrush! Please! No more! Okay, time to send you screaming to a dimension of infinite pain. Guybrush, no! Don't die! At last. I'm rid of that pesky little wimp Guybrush. Oh no! Ah, hey, I'm alive! Hey! I thought I was a goner. Oops. Oh gosh. Strange. There must be something wrong with my voodoo doll. Run, it Guybrush! I'm supposed to send you to another dimension, not the next room. Huh, <laughs> shoddy materials, I'll bet. Well, I guess I'll just try it again. Uh, no. That's okay. I 
I like that animation of him in pain. It looks really cool. All right, so this is the typical boss fight where we have to... Uh... Oh, no. You're gonna get it. It's too heavy for me to lift. Wait a second. <laughs> Root beer. Root beer should be we sufficient. got root beer. Hey, there's only one balloon in here. Oh no. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. I don't want a whole box. Are uh, you sure you want to do this? So we're going to constantly be running from LeChuck here. Oh, the treasure chest is all what smashed up. with a bunch of bits of broken treasure chest? What that is this? Seem to work. It says E on it. E what? This was inside the treasure chest. Oh, uh, we don't want to do that yet. Let's go in here again. This is going to be another achievement. <clears throat> It's an attractive green color. There's another achievement. Helium yeah, inhaler. You bilious bag of barnacle bait. You want to inhale the helium. It's stuck. It's empty. It's empty. There's nothing to pick up. All right. LOL helium. Oh no! Now you're gonna get it. No, now you're gonna get it. Let's bury the hatch. Uh, I'm just gonna be skipping through it because there's no reason to hear Guybrush screaming in agony all night. No. Hey, hey Guybrush, it's voodoo time. You won't let me go in the door. Um. All right, let's open up this. Let's see what other boxes they have. There's loads of root beer in here. One bottle of root beer should be sufficient. They're little generic voodoo Cupid dolls. I'll just take one. Cupid dolls? I don't think it was meant for that. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there's stuff in it. It's a pair of surgical gloves. Okay. Boy, does that look comfy. Surgical gloves. Remains, lost parents. Aha! Caught you. No! I caught you! Surprise! <laughs> Go back into the first aid because I didn't fully explore everything there. Holy cow, these are my parents! It's my dad. That wouldn't be polite. Hmm, this looks loose. I've disturbed them enough. Okay, so you know what we're trying to collect here? We need something from the head, something from the thread doesn't seem to work something uh, something from the head something from the now you're gonna get it body uh, let's discuss this like rational adults <laughs> hmm hey guybrush it's voodoo time railroad track must be a pretty small railroad uh, can't we talk this over? I can't pick that up. I'd love to, but I'm kind of pressed for time. It has that austere, but functional look. 
I can't move it. This is no time for playing doctor. This is no time to be playing doctor. It's a surgical glove. It's a surgical glove. I'd get everything all sticky. Hmm. Oh, there's a drawer here. Where am I going to put a drawer? Open it. It's just an ordinary drawer. There's a syringe in here. Pick it up. I better not. Hmm. Last two ingredients are difficult. Good luck. Hmm. <laughs> Vincent. All right, so I got the root beer. I got a helium balloon. I got the doll. I got the ticket. It doesn't seem to work. It says E on it. Surgical gloves. A skull hypodermic needle. Something from the head. Something from the body. Something of the dead. Thread, head, dead. What was the other one? Oh. Aha! Gotcha! Uh, here, try this. Remember Stan. Ugh. Now, isn't that better? All right, now we got something from his body. Body, head. That doesn't seem to work. That doesn't seem to work. Hmm. Remember Stan? I just remember locking Stan in the, uh... In the coffin. Oh, you were saying because Stan gave me the handkerchief. Hey, Code Mars. Uh oh, he's coming. It auto saved. Here we go. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. There's no need for violence. All right, so let's try to go through the elevator now. I think I grabbed the items. And, oh. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. All right, I can't even talk to him, so whatever. All right. I can't move it. Now you're going to get it. Lever. Pull the lever. Oh, you're upset. Dang it. No you pushed it instead of pulling it. <laughs> Let's try it again. Nine hundred pounds. Doesn't seem to open. Hmm. I don't see anything special about it. Are you available in my town? Good job, only one ingredient now. Okay. I 
I think this is the only other option, though, the elevator. Here we go. Now you're gonna get it. Uh, can't we talk this over? Dang it, he gave me no time. All right, let's try that again. Now you're gonna get it. Now you're gonna get it, LeChuck. Hold on. All right, so let's try this again. It's like he shows up whenever he wants to. Gotta be. Aha! Caught you. There's no need for violence. Why didn't that work? I'm supposed to catch his beard, I think, or something like that in there. I remember I'm supposed to get the wriggly part of his beard again. Sit in unnoticed corner. What does plaque say? Service elevator. One thousand pound limit. Hmm, that's why. How do I get this out of here? It's nailed shut. It looks very big and heavy. I can't dig that, Daddy. No, I want to save it for Elaine. Nine hundred pounds. It's nailed shut. It looks very big and heavy. I think it's a bit heavy for me. Hmm. Brings back painful memories. That won't do much. Eh, it's out of order. Pick it up. A veritable fortune. Oh wait, I think I know now. Let's see what happens. Wow, a 43 Steely. Yoink! That's something from the hey, thread. I rush. It's voodoo time. Maybe you're still too heavy for the elevator. There's no. All right. Now I don't see any other option. Elevator has to be it. I remember catching his beard in it. Rides on Chocobo. I love chocobos. They're the best. Let's go on, air guy brush. Now will you do some? Pounds. <clears throat> Ew, sticky underwear. I'd really rather not. That doesn't seem to work. Looks strong. Aha. Uh -huh. I don't think that'll work. It's nailed shut. It's nailed shut. If I ain't got nothing to open it. Can't dig that, Daddy. No, you can't. I can't dig that, Daddy. There's clearly a hole here, I think. No chocobos for turbo. <gasps> but I want a chocobo. get this dang crate out of the way. Here he is. Hey, Guybrush. It's voodoo time. Uh, let me explain. Uh, can't we talk this over? Okay. I need to get that crate out of there. 
But how do I get the crate out of there? Hmm. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Let's Not only can balloons be inflated, not only can the balloons be inflated. Try to go in here, but he's gonna blast me anyway. All right, so what else can be inflated then? Oh, the surgical gloves! Let's go. By the way, whoever now you're gonna get it. in chat, did, does anyone ever in the past play um, with inflatable uh, like gloves? Now I gotta go back here. I remember taking surgical gloves and, in, in like, inflating them. Okay. Now maybe I can... make it somewhat... lift up? No! You bilious bag of barnacle bait. No, that's not what I wanted you to do, Guybrush. Yes, I steal them all the time. Hey, Guybrush. I remember when I was voodoo time. I remember when I was a kid, I used to mess with them a lot because I always thought it was funny. Wait, wait, wait a second. I used to smack them around my house. All right, so I need to, to inflate the surgical glove again. Okay. <laughs> Might as well take it. <laughs> no. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Let's bury the hatchet. <laughs> Dang it, all the way to the other side. Ah. Hey, Guybrush. Will you it's Voodoo time. Shut up, LeChucks. You shut your trap. You stinking old zombie. Oh, come no, on. Get it. I didn't even get to do nothing. Um. Alright, fine. I wanted to be in here anyway. Alright. <sighs> hey, Guybrush. It's voodoo time. That doesn't seem to work. Uh, let me exp all right, so let's... That doesn't seem to work. Okay. So... Hmm. If you like point-and-click game, I recommend you play... I re recommend You Stupid Invaders is the most funny point-and-click game. I'll have to look into it. I also need to look into uh, the Thumble Park or Thimble Park as well. All right, now I gotta figure out how to get these balloons. Can I pick this up? It's too heavy for me to lift. It looks like it's been here a long time. It's nailed shut. I can't pick that up. Okay. Let's see if we can fit. Oh, man. Gotcha. Hold on.
Clock Tower 2 is a nice family friendly point and click. The, um, I played uh, Broken Age, Broken Age 2. And uh, that was a newer styled point and click family friendly game. It was actually a lot of fun. Aha! Gotcha! There we go. I guess it was just timing. Uh, what's this door? This is hauntingly familiar. That was Monkey Island 1! Remember this? Do you guys remember this? This is where Fester Shine Top showed up? Ooh, a circus! I love a circus! And I said, buzz off, Fester. Alright, so... That wouldn't do anything. That doesn't seem to work. Oh. Let's put this onto the juju bag. Well, that's one ingredient. Well, that's one ingredient and the doll. That's two ingredients and the doll. That's three ingredients and the doll. Now I know. Oh, I want to see him play Clock Tower. Okay, hey, brother, watch out, because I've got my own doll now. And I think I used the syringe on it. I don't think the chuck's close enough for it to do anything. All right, so let's go back in. Nice callback to Monkey Island 1, by the way. That was really cool. Aha. Uh -huh. Hey, Guybrush, it's voodoo time. Oh, that's pretty good, Guybrush. But not good enough to stop me. Now we're going to chase him around. How does he like it? Hey? Oh, it's you. What? That again? Ooh, look at me quaking in me booties. Take this, I LeChuck. I you and your puny voodoo tinkerings. Aha! Stab the doll again. You know, this doll reminds me of the stretchy muscle man I had as a kid. I had one of those. No. I'm much too powerful for you and your puny doll. It doesn't hurt. What are you going to do now? I wonder what would happen if I tore the leg off this thing. <laughs> Die, LeChuck. Guybrush. <laughs> what? Come over here. No way. I'm not that stupid. Yeah, don't go over there. But I want you to <clears throat> take my mask off. Mask? Uh, see the true face of your brother. Leg or no leg, I trust you about as far as I can throw Manhattan. I tell you, I'm uh, dying here. Take the mask off. Forget it. I'm not coming over there. You've got to see <coughs> my true face. Should I take the mask off? No chance. It just ripped my lungs out when I get close. <coughs> no, no, I promise. Please, come take off the... Oh. The mask. Should I pull the mask off? You should play Clock, Hour, Clock Tower 2 for October. The end. Good job. Bye-bye, mighty pirate. Litwack, take the mask off. Let's do it. Oh, all right. I'm coming over. Gently now. Remove my... <gasps> mask. <laughs> My god, you're my creepy brother Chucky. What? Did you think I was kidding before? How come you hate me as much as you obviously do? Well, you remember the time you broke my junior ultra soldier commando assault vehicle? Do you really think a truck is more important than your own brother? It wasn't a truck. It was <laughs> a junior ultra soldier commando assault vehicle. 
Look, Guybrush, could you help me out? Stick the leg back on the doll, okay? Will you promise to stop picking on me? All right, all right, I promise. Anything, just put my leg back on. Hey, you kids! Oh. You're not supposed to be in here. Ah, so there you are. Is everyone still with me? The old creepy brother Chucky trick, eh? You're booing? Look! They were kids! And Maintenance, fo maintenance found us in the tunnels! And we're at some sort of amusement park! Is this place? Well, it's not the screaming weenie hut where we told you to meet us. Your mother and I were very concerned. Thank you for hunting down your brother like we asked, Chucky dear. You boys didn't get in any trouble now, did you? No, no sir. sir. <laughs> Good. I wish you wouldn't run off like that, young man. We were worried sick. You don't know what kinds of murderers and ne'er-do-wells might be hanging around a place like this. Yes, Mom. Okay, Mom. I'm Guybrush Streepwood, a mighty pirate. You don't have to worry about stuff like that. This is weird what's going on here. I'm Guybrush Streepwood, a mighty pirate. I don't have to worry about stuff like that. Of course, dear. But please be careful. Well, come on then. Let's go ride the madly rotating buccaneer. Yeah. Big whoop. That's the end of Monkey Island 2 LeChuck's Revenge. Original game designed by Ron Gilbert. So awesome. So there is. There. Obviously. There's a big discrepancy with this ending. So there seems to be half the fan base that believes that LeChuck somehow used some sort of voodoo magic to manipulate Guybrush into making him think that they're brothers and that they're children, right? That's why he showed his eyes at the end because he's still evil. He's still evil LeChuck. He tricked him into this illusion of Big Whoop, or Big Whoop is an illusion, because nobody knows what the what the treasure of Big Whoop is. So he tricked Guybrush into this false sense of security that they're really brothers, and then manipulated him with Big Whoop. The other half of the fan base believes that this is true, that Guybrush that we've been playing for Monkey Island One and Two is in fact a child with his imagination running wild in this pirate theme park with his little or his, his older brother Chucky or LeChuck chasing him down every second that he can while he's on an adventure. I wonder what's keeping Guybrush. Oh, I hope LeChuck hasn't cast some horrible spell over him or anything. See? So there we go. Did LeChuck cast a spell on Guybrush making him think that he's a child? And that all of this going on was uh was real? What what do you guys think? What's your opinion on this? In my opinion, I think he cast a spell on uh on Guybrush. Only because I want to believe that games 3, 4 and 5 are canon when they were not made by Ron Gilbert. So technically this was Ron Gilbert's baby. Um so when it when it goes beyond these games, some some fan base feel that uh, some fan base feel like it, it's not connected to one and two. Definitely a spell, says uh, Carla. But yeah, so these are just the first two games. Now these these two games that we played here are 
the uh, special uh, edition versions of 1 and 2. So I flipped back and forth between the uh, pixelated versions just so I can see what some scenes look like um, in their original format. But so the next game that we're going to play is Curse of Monkey Island. And what is it, Thursday? I'll probably be streaming tomorrow, but a little bit earlier. Um, I just wanted to hear it. Um, that goes away from this type of environment, from the old pixels, from the even the remastered um, special edition, to an animation. Carl actually watched me stream uh, Curse of Monkey Island back on the Kano OK Gamer Twitch channel. So uh, Carl actually knows the uh, art style that it goes for. Um, but I'm very excited to do that. So what we're going to do here once the credits are done rolling, we're going to do some achievement hunting. We're going to go through the achievements. I know there's there's at least two that I need to do. Uh, one of them is beat the game. Uh, one of them is beat the game. Let me lower this because I'm... One of them is to beat... Uh, monkey island within three hours i think just like the last game that we did that's probably gonna be the one where we're gonna have to run through the entire game again real fast but we're gonna do it with skipping scenes um luckily there's no sword fighting in this game insult sword fighting so there's no like grinding um and since we played the game uh the last two days i should have at least some of the stuff um the puzzles relevant in my mind so we're going to try to do that. And then the other one, if I'm not mistaken, is we just have to kill Guybrush. And I think we just need to make him drown in the water. Or let him die at the pit. I forget which one it is, but I saved it both locations. I'm going to try the pit, though, first. Actually, let me pull up the achievement guide. Okay. Because we got four achievements when we beat that game. That was probably like not using hints and anything like that. Finish the game under three hours. Speed Demon. Uh, allow Guybrush to die. Let's see how this one... Okay. So that's what it is. So the, the, the letting Guybrush die is... Um... Alright, so let's, let's actually check the... Alright, we got 100%. Beautiful. Uh, so let's check the achievements real fast. So we got almost all of them. Let's double check. Okay, so we're missing two. So I'm pretty sure those are the two that we're missing. The Speed of Demon, under three hours. And then Allow Guybrush to Die. So we have the save file. I think it's this one. And we're just going to allow... He didn't say what he was going to do to me. So uh, An Ottoman comes to mind. We're just going to let this candle burn this rope, and then we're going to die here. So that's how we'll get the achievement. So we're just going to talk to Wally. So, Wally. Yeah? I love you, man. Let's keep our heads, shall we? So, Wally. Yeah? Could you please scratch my nose? Yeah, right after you kiss my butt. Oh, Wally. So, Wally. Yeah? Any bright ideas? Well, actually... I was hoping you'd think of something. Oh. So, Wally. Yeah? I've got a bad feeling about this. Ugh. Bad feeling? LeChuck's got you hanging in chains over a pit of acid and all you've got is a bad feeling? Gosh, I feel even worse when you yell at me. Just leave me alone. I can't reach the shield from here. Nice. I can't reach the shield from here. I can't reach the shield from here. I can't reach the balloon from here. I forgot I still had this voodoo doll. I can't do that from my present position. I 
can't do that from my current position. Famous pirate quotations. Happiness is a warm manatee. Old skunk eye. Kiss me, I've got scurvy. Guybrush Threepwood, 1600 Pennsylvania Avenue, age 21, pirate. The Joy of Hex. I think it's meant for advanced voodoo practitioners. The writing's way too technical for me. Oh yeah, my favorite book. The f <laughs> this stuff is really <laughs> repulsive. The f this stuff is really repulsive. I never use this organ at all. Beware a parrot. I bought that for no reason. Run free, monkey. I can't do that from my present position. Let the monkey run free. I can't do that from my present position. I can't do that from my current position. It's a plastic recyclable bottle of near grog. It's a plastic recyclable bottle of near grog. I can't do that from my current position. I can't do that from my current position. I can't do that from my present position. Present. Oops. Here we go. Hockey. You honestly expect me to believe you were disintegrated in acid? Sure. Well, I... And yet here you are telling me all about it, looking very integrated indeed. Yes. Well, that is... Uh, okay, so I embellished it a little for dramatic effect. Zoomy. Do you want to try telling me what really happened? Okay. As I was saying, we were hanging over the pit of acid. Death was so close I could smell his hairy armpits. Gross. There we go. So they're letting us do it again. All right. So we're going to exit. Go without saving. And we're going to start a new game, but we're going to do it as fast as we can. I'm going to get up and use the bathroom real quick. Um, so I'm going to put my BRB up uh, and I will be back in just a moment. And then we're going to run through this game as fast as we can. We got to do it within three hours. Um, hopefully it won't take very long to do it. Um, hopefully we can do it in two hours. And, uh, let me actually pull the guide back up again. I miss playing Sims 4. That's something that uh, me and Killer Cupcake are interested in bringing back. We may be bringing that in uh, April. So uh, if you guys, while you're sitting here in chat, if you want to look at that post that I have on Twitch on my profile, my feed, uh, you can find it on your mobile devices too if you're watching me on your mobile devices. Um, go ahead in that feed, put in the games or systems that you want to see me play in April. So I have some sort of heading. If you want it to be Sims 4, if you want more Animal Crossing, if you want something like uh, I didn't finish a fractured butthole, you want more Dark Cloud 2, you want little things like that, let me know. Um, and just put it in there and uh, we will start cycling through stuff. It's going to be a randomized variety stream month of whatever you guys want. You guys want me to play like Mario Kart on the Nintendo Switch. You want me to play some Super Mario Odyssey, Breath of the Wild. Uh, we can play some PS4 games. Um, as long as I have them, that is. Um, maybe some PC games. Now, if it's something that you guys want and I don't own it, um, you're always welcome to gift it. I think this is the only scenario in which I would feel comfortable with that. Um, but you're not obligated to. Please don't ever think that. All right, so let me go to the user restroom real quick, and then we're going to go in to get into the new game, and we're going to rush through this. Be 